Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video we're going to be discussing 3 golden powerful volume indicators that can help you avoid false entries in trading. Whether you're a beginner or an experienced trader, these indicators are sure to help you improve your trading performance. So sit back, relax and get ready to discover the secrets of successful trading with the help of these magic volume indicators. In Magic Indicator Strategies, our mission is to empower traders like you to achieve profitability in the markets. We understand that trading can be a challenging and complex task, which is why we're dedicated to providing you with the tools and strategies you need to succeed. So don't forget to like and subscribe for more great trading strategies and tips. First we are going to add the SSL Channel Indicator. which is based on the moving average of 10 periods and puts a range on it. It is a very good indicator but it gives us many false signals to take long and short trades in which. So we lose a lot of money. So we are going to see the first volume indicator called volume fight and you will be able to see how this indicator eliminates and filters very well these false signals that this indicator gives us. So we are going to add it to our chart. It is this one here, created by shuttle underscore club and personally I like to change the appearance of the area to columns to be able to see the indicator more clearly. I would like you to see how we are going to eliminate all these signs of false entries. Look at this area that is full of false entries that make you lose money. A lot of money. With this volume indicator we have saved out a lot of money. So how do we go about taking long and short trades? Here I share an idea. Let's look at an example of a short trade. We look for the volume fight to be showing a downtrend. This can be seen because the columns are red. And then to confirm the short trade we would look for a downward cross on the SSL channel. We then place the stop loss at the nearest swing high and set the take profit at a risk reward ratio of 1 is to 2. And we see that this bearish signal was fulfilled. Although sometimes we are not going to catch good signals like this, rest assured that we can catch very good signals if we stick with this system. Now we will see another long trade example. Here is the example of a long trade. We look for the volume fight to be showing an upward trend. This is seen when the columns are green. And then to confirm the long trade we would look for an upward cross on the SSL channel. We then place the stop loss at the nearest swing low, set the take profit at a risk reward ratio of 1 is to 1.5. And we can see this trade was a winner. Now let's look at the next volume indicator that will also give us a great advantage when trading. It's called squeeze index. Let's add the well-known super trend indicator. We're going to add to the chart this one created by Mahia Lucas with the following configuration and factor we leave them at 3 and in PD we change it from 7 to 10. It is a very super indicator, but it generates many false entries that make us lose a lot of money. Here we see that the super trend made us lose a lot of money. It can be seen with the signs of error. So we are going to add the squeeze index indicator created by Luxalgo to our chart and we are going to see how many false signals it will eliminate for us. But first we are going to explain how we can filter these false entries with this Luxalgo indicator. When the price is above the 80 line, it means that we are in a sideway market where the market is not going to have big movements. So we avoid this type of trading. But when the indicator is below the 80 line is when we are in a more volatile market. So we will take the trades when the super trend signal occurs. When the price is below the 80 line of the squeeze index, we can see that this indicator has removed a large percentage of false entries from the super trend indicator. So how exactly can we take trades with this indicator filter? The idea that I give you so that you can use it in your strategy is the following to take short trades, the super trend must give us a bearish signal and the squeeze index is below the 80 line. So we are going to take a short trade. We set our stop loss at the nearest swing high and our take profit could be a 1 is to 1.5 risk reward ratio. For a take a long trade, it would be exactly the same idea. 
We wait for the signal that the super trend gives us for a long trade and we see that the squeeze index is below the 80 line. So we set the stop loss at the nearest swing low and our take profit could be a risk reward ratio of 1 is to 1.5. Here is another example of a long trade we set our stop loss at. The nearest swing low and our take profit at a risk reward ratio of 1 is to 1.5. Although we could have earned much more. That already depends on what rules you set for your trading strategy. Amazing risk reward ratio 7 to 1. Now let's look at the last volume indicator. For me, this is the best indicator to avoid lateral markets. I am sure that if you add it to your strategy, you will be able to avoid 100% lateral markets that only bring you losses. Let's add the famous parabolic SAR indicator to the chart. As a trend indicator. We write PSAR with alerts and select the one that was created by Stiotz. We leave it by default. Now we add our volatility indicator. We wrote VQZLZ score created by Stefksags. We are going to go to style and we will change its shape to be able to see it more clearly. We select columns in inputs. This indicator has many configurations that you can try and something interesting is that you have the option of selecting more than 30 different types of moving averages to base the indicator on and rule out false entries ok. But to save you at work, I began to test which one was better and the one that filters the false entries much better. And I could see that the TMA is the best one that works. And in joint to filtering these false entries, it shows you when the price is heavily overbought and oversold with which you will know much better, which are the areas in which the price has a high probability of reversal. Where to take your trades. I hope you found this information valuable and it will help you make more informed decisions in your trading journey. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more trading strategy. See you soon. Thanks for tuning into our video in Market Accurate.